So this is the men's Armin jacket from Animal. Animal's a UK based company, so they really do heavily focus around UK borders and skiers. So be assured all the materials and features in here are going to keep you nice and comfortable and also help perform at the best as well. The material we've got on here to start with is a waterproof and breathable fabric. It'll keep you nice and comfortable as you said before. It's also a fully taped jacket this as well. So there's a lining of tape underneath all the stitching throughout the jacket which is going to help prevent any rain or snow from getting in via that seam which is going to keep you nice and dry inside. There's a barrage of pockets on here as well for you to keep all your bits and pieces in. If we start at the top, little zippered one inside of here, good sized little pocket that one. Also comes with a little goggle wipe in it and an elasticated cord. Another poppered chest pocket on the other side. Again, good size. We then have a little sideways stash pocket. Good place maybe to pop in your mobile phone, this one. Fit in there quite nicely. Two large bellow pockets at the bottom here. Again, with poppers and also Velcro this time. These are fleece lined pockets, these at the front, so keep your hands nice and warm. And a really good size on the front here as well. And down towards the side, then have another concealed pocket just behind there. Again, really good size inside. This has also got the waist adjusters stashed inside of here as well. So this is a little elasticated cord, one inside both pockets. If you give these a pull, this helps tighten the waist around the base. And they've also got a little clip inside of here as well, so you can attach your keys to keep them nice and safe. Go down to the sleeve. We've also concealed a little lift pass holder underneath the cuff adjuster here. Little window just underneath the cuff. Pop in your lift pass, keep it in there nice and safe, held in with the Velcro. Keep it in there for the duration of your trip, and especially if it's one of those magnetic passes that you do tend to get at some resorts, which you just wave your arm in front of the gate to get through to the lifts. You don't have to go fishing through your other pockets trying to find your lift pass. So, a really clever little idea. The cuff itself, elasticated at the back. And as we said, we've got those Velcro adjusters at the front here. So you can get a good tight seal around your glove and help prevent any snow from getting inside. We've also got the wrist gaiter inside of here as well. So this is a, a light cross section of material, hugs around the hand and the wrist nicely, nice and comfortable, and then stitched directly into the lining of the jacket. So it's going to stop any snow from getting inside to the main part of the sleeve, which is going to keep you nice and dry once you've popped your glove over the top. Up around the hood, there's a completely removable hood section this one, so there's a couple of poppers towards the front and also a zip at the back, so you can fully remove it. And also the first section towards the top here as well, again, just held in with a section of poppers, so you can take that off if you decide not to use it. The hood comes with full adjustment as well, so a couple of adjusters towards the front here. When you've got the hood up, you give these a pull, one on each side. This tightens the hood around the face, helps prevent any cold air or snow from getting inside. Round on the back, then have another adjuster. This adjusts the volume of the hood, single hand operation, so give that a pull. It squeezes the hood around the head, lowers the volume and helps give you better insulation and also a lot more comfortable as well. We've also got a peak at the front here as well, so if you do remove that fur, you've still got the peak at the front of the hood to help stop any rain or snow from getting into your face. And also a nice high rise collar at the back of the hood here as well. All fleece lined, so keep your neck nice and warm. Going inside the jacket, good strong baffle across the front of the zip. A couple of poppers at the top here. Held in with Velcro in the middle, and there's also another popper at the bottom, so nice and secure. It's just going to stop any rain or snow or cold air from getting inside the jacket via the zip. Also protects the zip nicely as well. Another little stash pocket just under the baffle here. Great place to maybe pop your goggles in, keep them nicely protected when you're not using them. Plastic zip on the main part here, which is going to avoid any corrosion from the snow. There's also a little fleecy tab towards the top as well, just to prevent the zip from scratching your neck or your chin once it's fully zipped up. Dual entry zip as well, so not only can you gain access from the top as usual, there's also another zipper at the bottom here, give you better access into your snow skirt or maybe your pants pockets. Inside, all fully insulated, so really nice and warm. The zipper pocket that we had on the front here also gains access through to a little headphone port, so you can stash in your MP3 player here if you need to as well. Feed your headphones up in through inside the jacket, so you can obviously listen to your music while out on the slopes. We then have another little small stash pocket on the inside here as well. Down towards the base, we have the snow skirt. Currently poppered back out the way, we're not in use, just saves it from catching on the zip. 
And you do need to use it, however, that should just unpop us from the sides here. And you can then popper it together in the middle. Got two poppers on this side and four sections on the other, so you can adjust the size of the skirt depending on your preference. Section of material at the top here, elasticated waistband and some rubberized sections on the other side of that band. So the way this skirt works is you do it up inside the jacket, that elasticated band hugs your body nice and tightly and helps prevent any snow from getting up inside the main section of the jacket, which is going to keep you nice and warm. There's also a, a little lycra section at the top here as well, so this is going to give you a bit more freedom of movement once you've got the skirt done up. And you can also completely remove the skirt via the zip on the side there as well if you don't want to use it. There's also a couple of little poppers hanging off the skirt as well, elasticated cords. This is so you can attach it to the corresponding animal pant, which is going to give you one solid barrier against the snow then, which is going to keep you nice and dry inside. As I said before, we've got the waist adjusters within inside the pockets, so you can tighten those up. And then we've got the section to loosen those off on the ends here, so you get full control over the fit around the bottom of the jacket. Underneath the arms, we have a little zippered panel. You can open this up from either the top or the bottom. There's just a mesh panel underneath there. This leads through into the main part of the jacket. So if you do get slightly too warm, it can allow a bit of air to circulate inside, help cool you down if you get too hot. And then once you've reached the knife temperature, you can literally zip these back up again and help retain the warmth inside. So a real top spec jacket. As we said before, Anna will be in a UK brand, so really nicely put together. It's all top quality stuff. This is the Armin jacket from Animal here at simplypeace.com.